the overall goal for every set, for every exercise to stimulate muscle growth. And that's why we're making the decision to use heavy or light weights is to maximize their ability uh, to build muscle at this age. In this video, I want to answer the question, should I use heavy or light weights when I am older? Should I use heavy or light weights when I'm older? So glad you're here. Hey, make sure that you stick around to the end of this video. I have a special offer uh, for you just for sticking around for this video. So do you use heavy or light weights and has that changed as you're older? Go ahead and post that down in the comment section below. Uh, tell me if you prefer to use heavy weights or now that you're a little bit older, maybe you're a little bit more conservative and you found it more effective to use lighter or moderate weights. Let me know that in the comment section. Also, make sure you subscribe uh, to uh, my YouTube channel and make sure on all of my social media platforms. So should you use heavy or light weights when you're older? That is a question that I get asked all the time the very first thing you need to understand is uh, weight training. It's about overloading the muscle. It's about progressively overloading the muscle and weight is relative. The first thing you always want to keep in mind so you keep your momentum going is always train safely. Uh, many of us uh, train in a home gym. Many of us don't have a training partner with our busy schedules. It's tough enough for us to get to the gym. Uh, so we don't have that extra safety or spots that you would need if you're really pushing yourself with the heavy weight. But you may hear that I got to train heavily if I'm going to stimulate the maximum amount of muscle growth possible. Your safety is, is so much more important. Your momentum, keeping it going, it's, it's not worth risking uh, training so heavily uh, that you're uh, risking the injury. All right, so that's most important. The other thing about heavy weight, it's relative. I mean, what's heavy to you might be a lot heavier than me or vice versa. It's all about stimulating the muscle, direct stimulation. There are a lot of different ways uh, to uh, continue your progress, to make those gains, to stimulate muscle growth, to initiate the process besides heavy weight. All right. It's form, it's feel, it's execution, it's consistency in the gym. Uh, all of those things uh, are very important mind muscle connection you got to set out with that intention that i am working that specific targeted muscle group rather than just moving the weight from point a to point b you can also make heavy weights uh, too heavy for you but you also can make light weights heavy uh, by that form feel execution the speed of the repetitions right how many repetitions you do in that particular set the overall goal for every set, for every exercise to stimulate muscle growth. And that's why we're making the decision to use heavy or light weights is to maximize their ability uh, to build muscle at this age. Is at the end of every set, you just can't do anymore. You push yourself further than you did the last time. You're progressing, all right? Not just in weight, but in form, feel, and execution, right? So you can use uh, lighter weights or moderate weights and do more repetition. So at the end of that set, you just can't do anymore and you uh, made slight improvements than the last time, all right? Demanding the muscle to adapt and grow. Or you can use heavier weight and have fewer repetitions in that particular set, right? And so it's the balance. It's just not heavy or light weight. Again, you always wanna be safe. It's all about stimulating muscle, progressing more. So wherever you start, What's uh, heavy to you now, uh, as, with that mindset of the one set that you're concentrating on, you know, who knows? What you think is heavy now won't be heavy later. All right, so there are a lot of ways, heavy, moderate, light, uh, depending on how you execute the exercise, how many reps, right? I prefer uh, moderately heavy weights, right? Again, staying safe and staying in that six to eight rep range Right, so that's important. So if you train in a 12 to 15 rep range, right, and you pick a weight that can, you can get all the way to 12, 13, 14, 15, that weight isn't gonna work if you just say, well, I'm gonna do six to eight reps too. 
right? Obviously, you're going to have to use heavier weight. All right, so I hope that clears that up. Hey, I want you to uh, let me know what do you prefer, and is this helpful? What do you prefer, heavy weights, or now that you're a little bit older, maybe playing a little bit safely, uh, lightening up the weights, maybe uh, more reps, uh, maybe even more volume, right? What do you prefer? Let me know that in the comment section. I want you to continue this journey that we have workouts for older men. I've got a special members only website for you. And in that special members only website, you're gonna get free instant access, lifetime access, right? I'm gonna issue, personally issue a username and password into the Workouts for Older Men members only website. I've got training routines, lots of different styles of training routines, uh, motivation, all right? I have uh, nutrition uh, plans in there. It's all stocked with the information and inspiration you need, training, uh, nutrition, the mindset, the organizing principles and systems, right? It also has personal development there for older men, right? So get free instant lifetime access into the Workouts for Older Men members only website. Go to workoutsforoldermen.com, workoutsforoldermen.com. Fill out that questionnaire. Fill out that questionnaire thoroughly. I wanna know all about you. I wanna know about your journey. What are your goals? right? What have you done before? What are your challenges? Uh, tell me if you work out in a home gym. Tell me what social media platform that you found me. I want to know all about you. Fill out that questionnaire thoroughly. Put your email address and phone number where I asked that, because when I know that you've played all out and you've filled out the questionnaire thoroughly, I'll reach out to you by a text, email. I may even give you a phone call and see how I can help you. Right, so go to workoutsforoldermen.com, get free instant lifetime access into the Workouts for Older Men members only website. I can't wait to learn all about your journey and how I can help you out best. So should I use heavy or light weights when I'm older? It's all about that execution. It's all about what you get out of the set. There's many ways, but you always wanna stay safe uh, during your training journey. All right. So, hey, make sure you watch uh, the videos that I have for you. Uh, I have videos that can really complement all this, how many sets and reps uh, that you should use. Uh, those will all tie in when you're figuring out should you use heavy, light, moderate weight now that you're a little bit older. All right. So thank you so much for watching this video. Post your questions, your comments. Like this video. Make sure that you're subscribed to my YouTube channel. and. Have a great day.